safety and I'm gonna get out. We're not pushing in, uh, in France at all. Yeah, they're probably busy with other stuff. I'm holding in Norway. I'm trying to push the Taranto from the south. Oh, he's attacking Rome now. He's not gonna take Rome though. Hopefully. I am pretty well dug in there. Need more troops in France, just let me know. If I can take Toronto, we're gonna have more supply in the south and then we can probably finish the pocket in the south. We find the yellow on air, that's good. Yeah. Come on, go to Taranto. I'm holding them there. My unit started, you can stop attacking, so I, I will take the attack. Yeah, like okay, in, they're not in moving. the Tyrant region. Yeah, with two days, right? Oh shit. Just stop attacking. Okay, can we get there in time? Two days. Tied up like what six tanks in here? Yep. And there are two more in France, so like that's like eight tanks. Here, have some more civilian factories because I need to get some stuff from you. You better don't need this one more. Oh, I'm broking the other mountain to the south. Okay. 
Good, good, good. Готов подвигаться. Oh, you didn't make it. That's unfortunate. But those are Italian tanks, though. <laughs> those are not German tanks. Yeah, the, that's gonna rout immediately. How's casualties looking like on your side? I uh, didn't have time to check. Okay, for now. Yeah, that's fine. Got uh, almost a half million casualties, but most of that was actually uh, from the yeah. the war in Japan and stuff. Taranto, here I come. <laughs> like Italy is gonna probably get wiped here. And this stuff Naples stuff, if you can get Naples then it's GG. Yeah. I mean once I push through this mountain line there is no nothing to stop me. There's space marine, they're attacking Rome. Two tanks, we're holding. I think it's almost impossible to get wrong. Yeah. Let's hope. They're looking good on the air front, yeah. I mean, the thing is, I'm dug in in Rome, so. Any city like cities are always hard to take. I still have full air superiority. Polish it is bringing more tanks to France. Looks like you are holding them off for now, Prince. Yeah. It's barely. Oh, we're losing a mountain uh, in the. Uh... Yeah, I know. We're going to lose it. She's quite. Divisions are not good. What can I do to improve them? Well, he did attack it pretty strongly. Like, I had a division there too, but. Them some more support equipment, I guess. Do I want to lose efficiency bonus? Uh, most of them don't have it anymore. By the way, uh, send something to take the port in, like, near Taranto, I'm gonna move up from there. Yeah. I love how there's barely anything that can pierce my tanks. Germany's losing quite a bit of... What's this? This feeder? In, in Norway, they're losing... They're still having like an auto attack on command. And they're attacking my... Uh, mountaineers there. Wish I had a bit more. A little bit more. 
line. Wait, why can't I teleport there? Norway. Oh, let's get away here. Can you um, hold them? Your two divisions up in the middle of Italy, like down south. There's a. Uh, you can keep moving. Like you can move one division forward and one hold the, the incoming troop. Yeah, I was busy in France. I kind of have to check France for a bit. It's yeah, sure, sure. Getting annoying in there. <laughs> Deficit of anti tank. Does any of my divisions have anti tank? No. Quite something. Not letting me. There we go, finally. Like 20 seconds. I'm about to surround this stuff in Italy actually. Yeah. Ah, you got there first. Unfortunate. Well, let's keep going though. Oh, we're about to actually connect. Yeah, exactly. That's what I was talking about. If you, can, uh, if you move your one troop there, you could have done it. Monsters wanna fall soon. After we connect, there is no way you hold that. Breeze is actually pretty. I'm gonna pair a small nice division here, some troops left. Some French troops. Any good? Doesn't matter, it's just a strike. About to take care to the airport. Yep. Oh, come on, AI. Do not land your troops in Norway. The supplies bad. That is. <laughs> Look at what back. they wrote. 
You're actually fighting back, uh, or getting terrain back, aren't you? What? Prince. Huh? I am fighting back in the south, yeah. Yeah. Uh, take, take a look at what they wrote in the chat. Much won the game. <laughs> yeah, if they can't push you back any like, further now. Look, uh, look, 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 look at look at Italy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just need Naples, man. We have got Naples. There is no way he defends it. I mean, uh, they're blockaded. How, what's their supply? The 36. How much do they actually need? Way more than 36. Yeah, exactly. There are way too many troops there. Uh, let's see, do we have enough stuff on raiding there? Oh, I did put my name on raiding. Yeah, yeah, but got, I got one to now. Uh, yeah, this one here. Oh, he's just running away now. Makes it even worse for your attrition. Southern Italy. Yep. Great. How, how many divisions are that? 32 Italian. Or He's not gonna, gonna run away with most of them though. 60, 62 divisions if they can't run away. They can. Not much we can do really. Uh, we can try to sink as many. Yes, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna. Where's uh, my other navy? Get some of the close air support to uh, go for ship naval strikes. I can't find one of my names. Oh. Okay, let's go common raising. No, I don't think we really have any more bombs. Oh, he's trying to take the port and... Trying to take the port where? Oh, north. Yeah. I don't have troops to attack into it currently. Uh, well, my division, if I get one more, then they Dude, should be able to hold. My light, my heavies are insane. Like, I'm looking at the stats now. They yeah, get like 800 mediums. And I only lost yeah, he's getting away now. Heavies. He's trying to get away. I told you your build is awesome. <laughs> we should lose heavies. Come on. Convoy raiding parties, come on. Build some divisions. Put air on the put air on the season. Yeah, I already did a bunch uh, I think. Um he's actually engaging with like a good navy there. I should probably engage with everything I have. How many ships do we have there? I'm sending 212, a bit more. 205. Oh, 
Oh yeah, we're fighting uh, the uh, Italian fleet now. You're not getting the convoys, it seems. Oh, you did hit one. But I mean, you can't really think a lot of ships, like, that's not possible. No, it's a it's, uh, question. Okay, it's got Naples now. Uh, how far into configuration is it be then? We just need, like, a couple of cities in the north. Not gonna be very easy to push from here. No, but some more naval landings. Although, mm, we are probably gonna get quite a bit uh, supply once we get Naples. Yeah. And I can build planning and then I can put, try to push. I'm currently building planning on the north as well, like in France. Out of my Norway. Those planes are excellent for heavy tanks, so you probably can. Okay, how's our supply taking now? Still a bit too much. 6245. You can, are you making. Uh, That's good more, enough. Uh, That's good enough. Make some more ports? Or? Nah, I think that's enough supply. I'm gonna build planning, then I'm gonna start pushing. Holy shit, how many freaking tanks does he have in France? And I'm gonna catch an Italian tank as well. Good. He has five tanks in France, like... Amazing. Bank somewhere and I don't know where. That sounds promising. Went so fast. Oh shit, they're pushing out in uh, Norway. Away. Слушаем! 
No support, I don't want to do support shit. By the way, uh, you should put your navy there. I'm covering the left side. You cover the right side for the... Uh... Yep, yeah. in front. No, I mean, you need to, I'm taking like the left part uh, oh, yeah, yeah, in yeah, shore okay. bombardment. Yeah. Okay, Norway is not looking good. They pretty pushed now. It's fine. I mean, you can treat Norway isn't too important. True. I'm gonna attack the attacker. <laughs> In that, the one that's attacking the port. We certainly don't want to lose the port there. I think may have added rocket artillery or something. This, this units just dropped a lot in strength. Oh shit, he's pushing me in France. Hell. No, it doesn't matter. Tanks still can't pierce. There's literally nothing that pierces my tanks that I've seen so far. Nothing. Pretty normal. I mean, like, pure heavies are extreme hard to pierce. Looks like it. <laughs> right, that makes me happy. I don't get it, why does it take you so long to move? From one coast to the next coast. But we're in speed one, that might be it. <laughs> yeah. Not make sense. My infantry that moved like two days earlier started moving two days earlier. It's gonna arrive ten hours later than the enemy that attacked me after I started moving. <laughs> They didn't swipe me. No, no. Keep. Oh, fuck. Stupid French divisions. They ruined everything. Ruined my supply. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna have the same problem soon in France. I'm going for a huge encirclement. In the north. Nice. Let's see if that's 
lost my voice. He's hitting France pretty badly. Okay, well, at least uh, with uh, 12 divisions, I managed to hold 60 divisions for a couple of months before they all died. Hold on, you can still move away, can't you? Can oh, I need air in northern France. I'll get away. Northern France, yeah. That's looking pretty annoying. How many do they have? Not that much. Uh, yeah, not that much air, but like he's pushing with the tanks pretty strongly. Dangerous. More close air. Holy shit, he's going crazy in France right now. Yeah, I was looking at that, it's like, wow. Well, they're really putting on a counter fence where we uh, landed. Only in Italy they can't really do anything. It's up in all of the mountains. I'm gonna start losing troops in there. I have to connect. Italian divisions will take three days to get there. Why do I take so long to walk? I don't oh, understand the tank, this. The tank. Yeah, the tank's gonna be there 11 hours. Let's stop the tank. Attack from down to the north. Now nah, I will get there. That tank cannot defend against me. Yeah, okay. just it doesn't have the organization. That's true. Taking so long to walk though. Really annoying vision. Get out of there. I'm gonna get like maybe 10 or so German infantry. Fucking walk. Finally. Продолжаем атаку! 
Yes. Got there in the last second before I started losing troops. He looks a lot thinner in places in uh, France on the coast. Then he, oh wow, he has 24 divisions he just deployed. I mean, I could uh, invade uh, later on, but I, I don't have enough divisions yet. Look at the north. Yeah, you're actually uh, invading. Yeah, you're doing exactly nice. How many divisions there? Uh, it's like 10. Okay, not, not, nice. The uh, casualties caps. are changing. Like, it started so badly with casualties, but now it's like... Anything helps. Yeah. But I do have a deficit of heavy tanks. I wish I could make more of those. <laughs> um, we're ready to continue, I think, now. If that's okay. okay. Yeah. And we can't see anything playing on, there's no way we're going to win this from here. Yeah. And Good game. Yeah. You did very well considering the build you were given. Yeah, I fucking... You haven't teched, you haven't teched heavies at all. Like, there was not, no unit that could uh, pierce those heavies I had. There's nothing. Well, I yeah, had I no anti-tank, man. I couldn't do shit against the heavies because the Germany before me hadn't teched and he hadn't teched heavies, so I teched some ASAP and started building them, but I don't know what I can do about it. Yeah. Not much you can do when you only have like a year until the war. Pretty much. I mean, we killed so many bloody Russians as well. Yeah, you Just did, but it's it's only. Back in a second, we were like the other two down. Yeah. It's still a lot. Shall we go, Shall we go up let's, then? I guess let's go. Alright. Yeah. Oh, they're gonna go down. Okay. Hello. Hello. Hello, Hello Dave is stuck at Prince. Thing. Yes, you killed Prince. Russians, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. But you only you only killed infantry, so I don't care. I How know many? for like first month of the war, <laughs> 1.5 million Russians got destroyed. How many of the casualties did you have in the end? 2.5 million. And they, they, Germany had about 400k, Romania about 300k. It's funny. Like the glorious Romania. <laughs> Which is still cost effective for me because I killed. Like, yeah, it's fine because it's infantry. Uh, you kill like 11 or no, 16 divisions. Yeah. I lost just infantry, so they're replaceable. That is true. Oh, wow. Okay, Stalin. <laughs> yeah. I did lose one tank. I don't know where I lost it. I didn't see. But I lost it somewhere. Uh, but like, even speed one, just playing solo is very hard. Yeah, I lost several tanks in the north just because I wasn't paying attention, basically. Yeah. I don't think I lost any mediums, though. Oh, the, one the war in Italy was really, really fun, by the way. I, I, li yeah, I yeah, liked Dunkirk, fun. okay. <laughs> <laughs> Dunkirk. <laughs> that was Dunkirk. Yeah, exactly. We didn't manage to sink, well, one convoy, maybe. <laughs> I don't know why you guys didn't invade Greece. There was nothing there. I was, I'm trying oh. to do it now. Oh, okay. After the uh, AI showed you the way. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I France. saw like, oh, oh shit, there's nothing there. <laughs> the, there was nothing there the whole time. So the, the reason my troops showed up in uh, Italy was because I pulled them out of Greece. So. And Norway, you didn't have any troops there, but you managed to pull it back. The, the might of Italian leadership and German troops. Yeah. I basically just forced to put like all the infantry I had left in no. the queue when you invaded Norway and sent them that way under Italian commands. I was getting attrition at the end because the French and troops in Norway is like why France? I mean, did you lose anything to attrition in the battle? Um, probably not. I don't know. 
I mean, that, that's central Italy should have been able to do that. You had like no. one level 2 poor and you were supplying like half a million troops from it or something, and you were getting no attrition. Uh, I mean, uh, I have 45 <laughs> Exactly, it's ridiculous. Yeah. It's 2.5 supply, so I can go 2.5 over. So, US joining early won the war? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. yeah. And a shit German build. Like in Japan, Japan, yeah, Japan, Japan dying like in two weeks, basically. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that, was, that was so good. That was still the highlight of the game. <laughs> I mean, to me, the highlight is that it, that he managed to do it with both island nations. Yes. Yeah. First UK and then Japan, and both times to battle. He he <laughs> just dies in like two weeks. Like the entire stuff is undefended. <laughs> 24 divisions in Japan. 24! I mean... At the point he saw that the US was going 80 naval dockyards, he might even have just pulled... Like, he could have pulled back everything from the islands. I mean, the, the funniest thing was, like, Tokyo was completely empty. And, like, I just walked in there. I think he just literally had 20 troops that were sitting mostly in the south. Yeah. Around Nagasaki and Hiroshima. Like in, in the northern part, I think there were like what four divisions or something. I mean, I didn't have anything when I invaded them. Like I had like what twelve divisions or something like but, that. But but don't worry, we had fifty divisions out in the islands. <laughs> I, I basically invaded them with nothing. Like I thought I would, I was like gonna die and just retreat. My plan was to take just a port near Tokyo and then retreat, but then I, I, I was like, oh, oh, he has nothing here. <laughs> wow. I like wow. that we had quite an insane air war, where we actually had to juggle around with quite a few airplanes. Like, you had a lot of air superiority in the beginning against oh, me. Oh, now you like, have 4,000 planes in Italy? Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, we just kind of, Italy was doing all the air, and I think I was probably shouting him a enough. bit. Unintentionally, just because I didn't know where the air was, it was just horrendous. <laughs> I mean, there were like, uh, there were place, for example, uh, for like a month or so, the UK just kept like a thousand fighters in Italy, and I just didn't fight them at all, because it was there was no like, CAS or any um, strat bombing going on, so I just Man, decided like... to, you know, not use the airplanes. I think heavy tanks are pretty necessary for defending France. Like my marines are dealing quite a bit of damage to medium tanks. The one that played the UK before didn't even invest any technology in our, our production into tactical or strategic bombers, so only yeah. close air. Yeah, I mean I've got Fighters. a lot of factories on heavy tanks now. I've got like 50, 60 factories on heavy tanks. I just can't build enough now. <laughs> it's just too late starting. Yeah. And I was starting on medium things. But I, I have five things. lines on heavy. I can't even. I didn't even finish like putting them in the marines yet. Yeah, I know. They're so fucking expensive. No, I, yeah. I mean, I might actually want to play like, Hungary next game. Be I did fun. change one of my medium templates to a medium with a heavy armor on it. And that worked a lot better against your space marine because you couldn't pierce her. Yeah, I have 51 piercing. Maybe I should go. Maybe TD instead of heavies. I don't know. I don't know, the heavies worked quite well, but like my, I'm trying to find my template now. I mean, heavies are pretty good at attacking, but yeah, I guess I cannot. You need pierce. the breakthrough. I mean, like I've got 63 armor, 76, 67 piercing on my like, Yeah, I wouldn't be able to pierce, pierce uh, heavies even if I did have a heavy TD anyway. Yeah. Yeah, it's really actually hard to invade France, I mean. If you had heavy tanks, I don't see how I could ever hold a landing in there. I don't like, think you could. But I mean, the Soviets, with a decent German build, were really in trouble, I think. Because there were eight divisions just, like, constantly kept back to guard... Eight medium tank divisions constantly kept back to guard against your landing. Yeah, that's true. It basically, it lets Soviet win. Although, the Soviet heavies were just fucking horrendous. Oh, yeah. They uh, that's I think that was the only time Prince um killed any of my divisions. He killed sixteen of them with four tanks. Yeah. 
<laughs> that was, I was just That's, like, wow, just couldn't, the plan? Just couldn't do shit yeah, against Yeah, I, I just didn't... Yeah. The, the, the Soviet tanks are like... Uh, top level division, I mean, it's great division. But I'm assuming yeah, they must insane. be taking horrendous casualties to cast though, it seems like. When we actually have air superiority, I'm assuming you must have lost a lot. Uh, the prince know. said he lost one, so... I lost no, like, in actual though. fights, though. I don't know how much like, actual material losses. Yeah. You could look in your... theaters. Yeah, if you pick up, like, a little buck, booklet and go to equipment, you can see how much you lose. Oh, you guys gonna actually count the pass. Because I didn't lose much. I lost 150 heavies in the past 12 months. 150 not, shit. Yeah, which is not that much. And uh, you lost 960 mediums, 850 lights. So that I lost, lost, I lost 1700 lights. mediums uh, at some Did point. You? Okay. Well, on, on my front it lights. says 158 heavy tanks and 52 medium tanks. That's it. Yeah, I mean, I killed 43 heavies, but a lot of them were US from the looks of it. Is that a KV? It looks like a KV. It is. Yeah, okay. Soviet just killing it. Well, to oh, be fair, to we, we did man. do a bit in the, in the beginning. We wiped a third of his army in two months. Give us six and we got a decent shot. Yeah, you didn't wipe yeah. a third. I had like 600 and then I dropped to like... You've, you've lost two and a half million manpower. Or you don't have a... And you've got and like five million left. Yeah. Would you have yeah, broken okay, through sure. without invasions in uh, of Italy and uh, France? Didn't have to divert men. Possibly, it would have been. It would have been. Closer. It's hard to say. It's I don't think. Say. I don't think Prince would have been able to go on the offensive because we would have had, still had Cass and their superiority. Yeah. Like our Cass could stop his heavies. Yeah. I, if, when you had like all your fighters here, I could never get their superiority. Almost anywhere, so I was in lots of trouble. But you guys had, if I look at it, at least 16,000 planes, according to my info. Was it yeah. not enough to get enough planes in Italy and the Soviet Union? Or no, you guys had like 30,000 well. total between the US, yeah, UK, total. and yeah. yeah. I mean, yeah. you looking at Italy is like our total amount of planes, right? Yeah. yeah. I, I, and I, then you look at the UK, and they have more than me. Do I? How many is the UK got? 7 14. to 23k, according to my information. Oh, 14 is in total. 14, yeah. so... So, yeah, Italy's got 16, so Italy's got slightly more than the UK. But, yeah, but then we the also US have the... Soviet Union have separately. Yeah. yeah. Planes. The US doesn't have that many. I'm assuming what the US has got is carrier planes, but the Soviets have got quite a few as well. But yeah, I mean... I mean, we're competitive, and we also killed competitively in the air, for the most part, but... Yeah. I didn't even look. How, how are your dudes... How are your fighters doing against mine? Uh, at the start, they were losing slightly more, and then eventually they were evening out the odds. At one point, I was killing you quite a bit more in Italy. Or it's like yeah, 3 to 1 losses. At some That's point weird. you got a lot more uh, planes in, I guess. Because like... Hold on. Over the years, last months... I had 1940 fighters with maxed out operational integrity. In Italy, 740 enemy fighters lost to 400 our fighters lost. But that's still, those are not bad numbers. 1100 to 1400 over the years. That's what I have here. Mm, it's weird. And the Italian one. That's weird. How come we have different stats? Doesn't even show anything in years for me. Weird. It doesn't show anything in years for the yeah. Russians at all. <laughs> Only yeah. Italy. Oh, that was a good game. Yep. Well, as
Yeah, well, Prince, Prince, Prince if, if you want to set up another one, I can't do it next weekend, but the one after, I could join. And yeah. then all of August. Maybe, maybe. I'm not sure I want to be, like, actual admin and things, though. You're not gonna get another Marconi. <laughs> Or are there any good like multiplayer ones on the forums right now? We're starting. Uh, there's Road to War, which is on Sundays, which is kind of. I think we've had the first session of that, but people are always welcome. And the Thursday game is starting again on Thursday, but I don't know how many people are going to be there for that. Sad thing about Sundays, I have an EU4 game on Sunday, so. Cannot join uh, my poor game on Sunday. Oh my god, I am actually not in that yet. I haven't signed up. Haha. -ha. Yeah.